What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Runes Overtrain Lifestyle. Early morning, about to go to the gym and smash out some compound movements. Do a whole lot of cardio. I'm getting to that point where you know when you get bulky and it doesn't feel healthy. That's how I feel. And what I found is when you do cardio, you sweat all of that, whatever's making you feel down, out. So do a whole lot of cardio, load of compound movements today. I'm outside in the fresh air. Early morning, I'm just getting a bit of good nature in my body it's always good it's cold today but you know sometimes it's good for you anyway what I wanted to talk about today is having no confidence for the gym the reason I wanted to do this video is because I know there's a lot of people around my circle and there's people loads of people out there that really want to go and train they want to go and do good but they just have no confidence to go to the gym and that is the wrong way to approach this thing the right way to approach this thing is you don't have confidence to train because you don't know what you're doing. Um, I'll explain. Um, if you, The main reason people don't want to go to the gym and if you ask them it's because they say, I don't know what I'm doing or um, I'm scared people will look at me and watch what I'm doing and think, oh, you're doing it wrong, etc. And yeah, that is true. What I would do first of all is I would get familiar with working out. Have a look online. The internet is your best friend. There's everything now on the internet. YouTube, Google. If you want to work out how to do legs, there's loads of exercises. I would work out how to train first of all. So I do everything at home or outside by myself. Just get familiar with training. You're obviously never, you've never trained before. So get familiar with training. Do that for the first eight weeks. I'd say a minimum of eight weeks. This is really going to boost the confidence. Have a look. If you want to train, I don't know, if you just want to lose weight, go do your running, cardio, look for different exercises. That eight week period is that minimum time frame you need. Once you've done that, then go to the gym. And, and honestly, it will make a huge, huge difference. Obviously, for some people, you can just say, you know what, fuck it, I'm going to the gym and I'm going to do it. But for some people, it's not that easy. A lot of people will suffer from anxiety and, you know, like paranoia and things. So what I'd say is get used to training, first of all. Now, number two, what you have to remember is in the gym, people are there for themselves. They're trying to work on themselves. They're trying to figure out their own sort of they've got their own problems because if they didn't they wouldn't be at the gym you know they're even the biggest guys or the you know the strongest women or whatever they're there because even myself you know we're there because we just want to keep improving we feel these things that are not right yet think about it if we if we didn't go to the if we felt that we were perfect and everything was okay we wouldn't bother going to the gym so everybody's there for their own reason they don't give a fuck about what you're doing there and they're not really bothered even if you're doing if you do do something wrong there's always people there to help you or you can ask someone or you can quickly check on your phone about the right way of doing it and i'd say even if you're doing weight start off light everything light and that will really make a difference. Don't go in there and ego lift if you're if you're looking to start lifting. Don't do that. That's silly. And what you have to remember as well is I always take. Should I, t I take? Um, you know when you see overweight people that are trying to lose weight and they're running. Think about that when they're running outside and you drive past. They're driving past loads and loads and loads of cars, different people. And what do we do? We only look for about two seconds. And normally we just you know. And most of us will say good on them you know they're trying to do something we're dry it makes you feel bad when you're driving and they're running you know and you think fuck you know it gets you a bit motivated so just listen don't worry so that's my, my, my bit of advice i would say train at home give yourself an eight week period to learn all different exercises you know there's so many even if you have to go and get yourself some cheap weights go and do that and learn how to squat and learn different things i don't know what if different techniques i don't know whatever you you're trying to do or trying to you know do with your body go and learn it and then go to the gym and just remember nobody gives a fuck everybody's there for their own reasons and they don't care and that's it that is my advice peace